go. Seems we're up. Good evening, everybody. I'm Rhodes. I'm Rhodes. Hi, I am Ro I am Rhodes. There we go. Said it properly. <laughs> and we're playing Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone again. Um, this would be the finale today. Yes. Um, let's just see. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. I hope to God that's like. It's probably because you. Because it looks like the save file from the beginning. You were in the middle of a control yeah. chase, no, so no. maybe it doesn't have a picture for that. It probably doesn't. We should be right at the bit with the troll. Yeah, escape the troll. So we're about to. Um, yeah, run into the toilets, uh, destroy a couple of toilets. Well, and, and then basically stick a wand up a troll's nose. It's Harry Potter, things get weird, you know. Um, yeah. Loaders. I'm going to be doing this for like three hours, so. They are a bit. Um, I'll just, while I'm doing it, it's probably going to start. Oh, shit. Shit. Just as I pick the fucker up. Oh. Oh, great. <laughs> I was just about to say hi to you all in chat, but never mind. Hello anyway, I don't need to, um, yeah, let Dion do it. Uh, mind you, she'd be signed into her account and not ours, so. Yeah. Um, that's not after the best start, is it? <laughs> First death of the session. Uh, imagine putting a save point there, though. Mind you, it's it's... We, we we had to be the ones to fucking like stop playing right there. Yeah. To be fair, we were pretty sure you're supposed to finish this section before you stop playing. To be fair, we were exhausted. Oh, oh shit! I missed the beat. It's all right. I got like nearly five hundred. Got enough for Fred and George. More. Cheers. Bath and Beyond. Twenty twenty two. Yeah, let's get it. Yeah. Uh, surprisingly small reaction there. If I got hit by a toilet, I'd be doing more than oof. Yeah, mine just you know? got hit with a hole. Trip to the infirmary would be in order, I think, you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It wouldn't be standing. There we go. The Weasleys are made of tough stuff. Yeah. Yeah, you want to see Molly in the last film. She fucking, like, goes beast mode. She drops, she drops a, a swing. Get off her, you bitch! Yeah. Basically to that effect. How 
many, like, th there's not even enough toilets in this room. I know, we're getting Where's he finding all this thing. stuff? Nintendo. Pan down. Nintendo. <laughs> it's not as bad as last time we were just chained in that shit. Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Are you alright? Right down. Thanks for saving me. Oh, folding her. Um, is he dead? She's like, just I think it's so just been knocked out. Like, been knocked well, out. Come you on, boys are let's get out of yeah, here. Lick my feet. She couldn't give a shit about the fact you just saved her life. Yeah, just like you fucking simps. Get down. Get down. <laughs> on your knees, pigs. <laughs> oh, you've got to do another quiz match. Yeah, we do. Ah, oh, someone's tuned in. We see you in chat. State your name and clearance code. <laughs> oh, it's a red dwarf reference again. With the troll, Harry, Ron, and Hermione returned to the Gryffindor common room and discussed the strange goings on at Hogwarts. It's a troll. It's just another day at the office. Harry suspected that someone had released the troll to distract everyone so that they could so that they forbidden Gryffindor. Yeah, there they, wasn't it's, much uh, time freaking freaking out, out who was behind <laughs> this. Like Especially since he was busy preparing for the second Quidditch match against Ravenclaw. Ravenclaw, no. My own house. Yes, oh well, fuck him. Welcome to Quidditch! I'm your potato. Lee Jordan! Ooh. It's Gryffindor versus Ravenclaw! Yep. Let's play Quidditch! Should we see if Quidditch. I can beat my personal best? A glint of gold? Is that the snitch? Oh. Here's up the bludger! Near Mr. Water! Ow! Here comes the Raven Claw Seeker! Potter seen the snitch! Right, 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 right. Oh, the fuck's it going? Amazing skill! Oh, that was blood! Oh, oh, no, no. Stay on target. Ah, you bastard. There we go. Oh, it's quicker last time. <laughs> oh, when I was a kid, this would take like Thanks to Harry's half an hour or so because I was a Gryffindor one that you match know, against when you're a kid, Ford. you're a dumbass. But then when you're uh, older, Harry 17 Ron seconds. And, Hermione spent most and now we've got to deal with Hagrid's problems again. We've got him in the fucking fire seeds, hatched the fucker, and now we've got to get the fucker back to Romania. Do it yourself. Surely you know how trains work. Eventually, after much coaxing, especially because you put me on one to get me here in the first place. Well, you didn't actually. You told me which train to get, and then you fucked off. And then I had to go and ask some fucking gammon where platform nine and three quarters was, and he was like, "Are you fucking joking?" Harry, I've heard it all, but I ain't never true. seen me know platform nine and three quarters. Silvery slipped out. <laughs> it's an invisibility cloak, said Ron. They're very rare. Oh, there was a note. With They're not cloak. that. Well, your father left this. Actually, yeah, it's the only one in existence. It's the most deadly hallows. A very merry Quite Christmas rare. to you. Can you see the face of Ron then? Look, that looks <laughs> fucked up. He tried on the cloak. Yeah, always looks well, that was nightmare fuel. I can see the back tower. of his head now through his head. Careful, Mental. Harry. Said Hermione. You can't stay invisible while you cast spells. Filch might see you. Filch might. Yep. And now we are where we were before. It's been a long journey, but now we're back. Started at the bottom, now we're here. That was cringe. Don't ever let me do that again. Do what? <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I don't know, they probably heard. One secret area, one secret wizard card. I'm sure <coughs> they're probably one and the same. Most, yeah, most, most wizard cards tend to be in the secret areas. Oh yeah, no, it's just in the middle of the corridor. Someone dropped it. With Norbert safely bundled the amount of secret areas Harry set off for the tallest tower. Something. You'll see him just he hoped that the cloak would conceal it from I mean, I understand it with him because he's Mrs. like the, nice. he's like the housekeeper sense. janitor person. So it's a bit see. suspect there. Where? He needs to what's get what's he got in those secret areas? He's just got to get to places quickly. You know, so what, he's like going off to Epstein's Island. When he... Again, these are these. That's that is not any language I know. Yeah. You are a bar, and you can fuck yourself. Unless you're a real person, in which case disregard everything I've just said. 
but I'm pretty sure that's a bot. I don't know what vom dot whatever that is. I don't even want to repeat it fully because it might like. I don't know. <gasps> Hacking is is weird. He, he's already seen me. Get the fuck down. Get fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Bleh. Where is he? Yeah. Pray I don't find you, my stealthy little. Stupid. I am solid snake. I am solid Gryffindor. I am whatever. I am solid lion with fire. Whatever. Oh bollocks. Why can't I grab all the shit? I should stop running around everywhere. Yeah, true. He can't get me there though. I can just piss on him from here. I can just be like, yeah. Where Take some of my yellow justice. Slime. Oh, Harry Potter. I'll Potion catch you. Too. Yes, I will. True. There's a reference. I know. Uh, bean. We did all that for a bean. It's a lot of effort for a bean. Yeah, I'm gonna have to research what the fuck these are when people just those weird minky things mm. um, it doesn't seem to do anything really but fuck off I'll catch you Hi. and when I do yeah. you regret it fuck you're gonna do <laughs> right save here we go Onwards, and now you're seeing the bits of the game that we didn't play initially. Oh. Lost the save file. This is where we would have been beginning um, yesterday, but we're back, and we're going to finish it. Yes. And we're going to find out what Fred and George have been doing with those beans. It's going to be great. I don't actually even remember what they do with beans. <laughs> you don't. I've I've alluded to it several times during the. I know, they, during do, this arc. they do our thing with the beans, but I don't know what the thing is. I'm gonna go up there first, get the beans, and then come back down and do the oh, spells and stuff. I bet he's right up my ass right now. Oh. If he's going Ugh! everywhere he goes, it's no surprise that Filch is gonna be like sniffing you, like you know. Whatever. You know what my words are. He doesn't strike me as a nonce. He ah. strikes me as the kind of person who... Oh no, he hates children. Yeah, he really, really hates Except children. Except for when he's playing the doctor. Help. Then he's David Bradley and he loves children. Consensually, of course. <laughs> I think platonically uh, would have been the more yeah, correct whatever. word to use. Whatever, my one was more funny though. Um, edgy, but funny. Help. In fact, no it wasn't. I changed my mind. And now it's going to run out of Um, I might have fucked myself. No? Is he going to stay near the door? Okay. I What's guess we'll just have to creep. Who's that? Someone's got past me. Oh no, we've got a staircase. Great. Uh -huh. I forget this is a kid's game. There's no massive amount of stealth needed, really. So just don't be a complete idiot and then you're fine. Uh, unlike the fucking Prisoner Azkaban game. Oh. Okay, no. Stealth was, stealth was ridiculous in that game. Can you imagine Intruder. being like a caretaker and just... Intruder. Doors and shit are just opening while you're trying to like... Stand watch and shit. Yeah. It'd be freaked out. It'd be like... Uh, it'd be on some like fucking... Um, reality TV show, you know, like like last night with the ghost stories. like. And then, and then I just tripped over and, and fuck, my, my face went into a he fucking didn't, bench. He didn't trip over, he was on his knees cleaning the stairs and his yeah. face got smashed And Harry just stairs. took my head and just fucking BOOM! Cut. <laughs> but yeah, Get no. down. Do you know what, that's something that's been proper disappointing me lately, the TV at night times, right? Yeah, it's not Our Christmas, options it? last night were absolute shite. We had serial killers. It was the news, which is depressing. Serial killers, which is depressing. Yeah. Particularly horrible one as well. It was like some dude who worked at like as a paramedic who ironically was like abusive to his wife and ended up killing her. Stabbed the fuck out of her. Because she wanted to press charges against him for the said assaults. Yeah. And I'm like, oh Christmas. Christmas guys. So Lovely. that was fucked up. Then it was ghost adventures, which is Which I found fucking hilarious. Need it wasn't I even scary. It was shit. She was a little bit scary. I wasn't. 
It was really just like we saw a stranger apparition and I'm like, are you sure that wasn't your fucking camera guy? And then they heard a loud noise and I'm like, that's oh, someone just tripped over a chair. Like, fuck him. There we go. But yeah, so the selection of TV last night was not great. To be fair, I need to pull yeah, up It's a always the chase. Intruder. That fucking Intruder. game show. In the forbidden corridor. Uh, like, you, 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 you. Forbidden corridor? Doesn't look that forbidden. Normally it'd look a bit more spooky if it was forbidden. It's because the knowledge is forbidden. Uh, dost thou forbid me? We have to wait until he gets out of the way. Hey, check it out, right? We're streaming on time. I know. It's crazy. Can, 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 I, can I just... Hey, there we go. Is that is that gonna? He just got is he gonna react? No, he didn't. No, there we go. Whoa, there, there we go. go. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking a, door open. Oh, yeah. Bit of a delay. <laughs> He's like Boris Johnson when he sees a party. He like, oh yeah, <laughs> gotta get Missy Chris Hamner out. Oh, <laughs> COVID for everybody. That did not land very well, so yeah, yeah, fuck it. Well, tell that's Boris. His fucking secret Senate didn't land too well with the public. No, it did not. Uh -huh. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Now, how can I get up there? Ah, uh, now somebody else has popped in. With an equally weird... Well, well, we what? are in trouble Yeah, it now, seems the other one deleted the message. Oh, I got caught. Mm. Oh, shit. I was distracted by fucking weird bots. I can't go into my thingy and, and block him, but whatever. I need to find out how to make you a mod, actually, so you can do that. Mm. Like in, in times like these where I've got, like, playing a game and I can't go back to the thingy. I don't get it. It happens all the time. There's even on videos that I upload. Some weird, like... And then I go into my comments and it's not there. So, I don't know. Sus. Weird dead accounts. It's probably some weird, like, um... Blockchain or something that, like, um... Not blockchain. You know, you know those things that people set up where it's like a network of computers that have been taken over? What's that? It's probably that, but the project failed, but it's still kind of doing its thing. Where are you, you sneaky slime? You, I'll catch you. No. Yes, I will. You've got to get all the beans. Well, I mean, if it was anything else, I'd know about it, because I, you know, I do, I do check out these things. I make sure that nothing's... It's just a bit disconcerting when you see a bunch of weird letters on a, in your chat. Like, what the fuck is that? Admire in your wand. How far can I stick this up my arse? <laughs> Without it hurting. <laughs> uh, you'd probably be best off starting with the handle first. Yeah, true. Oh, it's changed again. <laughs> yeah, actually. <laughs> That's weird. Lillian McCachlan. I doubt it. That's probably not even now, It's usually like someone's account there? that got taken over and, and then you've just got some weird bot doing it. No need to worry though. From what I do know, um, you can't just ruin a stream just by typing some words in a chat. No, no. Other than if you type the N word. Yeah. In which case, we'd have to block you, wouldn't we? Yeah, don't don't repeat anything that. It's, yeah. Yeah, Even I'm not gonna. Cause saying it might trigger some kind of. You know. <laughs> Technology is scary at times. Anyway. On with Harry Potter. I'm pretty sure a lot of small streamers have this exact issue where there's just like some dead account trying to like. To be fair, some weird shenanigans. I think you can turn chats to subscribers only for future reference. That's an idea. If we're going to get this every stream. Then, uh, seems like. I don't know. Some of my subscribers are probably bots, though. 
YouTube is fucked. It's broken. It really is. No, we don't. I ain't using Twitch. Everyone wants me to use Twitch. I don't want to. All of my favourite streamers fucked off to Twitch. Well, then, wouldn't you want to be where they are? No. They betrayed me. No, they didn't. Yeah. No, of course. I want to be that one streamer that's still on YouTube. Reliable. Easily found. You know, I don't want to be that cunt who just fucks off to another platform and goes, Hey, oh, everyone, you need to now sign up for a different website to carry on following me. No. No. If you watch me here, that's where you're always going to watch me. Because that's what you signed up for. I don't want to make my subscribers jump through hoops just so they can watch a bit of fucking Harry Potter. Okay? That's my stance on it, anyway. Maybe in, like, I don't know. Five years when when no one's watching us anymore because we're boring. I don't know. Maybe they will move. Where is he? But for the time being, find you, we've got everything we need right here. Student. Oh, that's not changed in a while. I don't know. It, it happened last time, but it didn't really change. And it kind of stopped when um, Evelyn popped up. It seems that's what stops it, just other people getting involved and commenting. So, you know. Oh. Did he just fucking... No, 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 no. Fuck off. Fuck off. No. No, oh, thank fuck. That was scary as balls. <laughs> he's, he, oh no, please don't tell me he's stuck here. No, I'm sure he'll wake up his way across. That was some scary shit. <laughs> okay. There we go, he's finding his way. Making my way downtown. Something, something. I don't know. I don't know. Walking the fast. Faces fast. That's the one, yeah. <laughs> he is going to walk. It's a good song. Right. We've got nobody to sort of check if the audio levels are fine. I'm going to assume they are, though. They were fine last time, and we've changed nothing since. True. It's going to be really, really um, heartbreaking, though, if no one can hear what the fuck <sighs> we're saying. It yeah, the, the frame's always a bit weird. Um, we've been up there, so I guess we'll be down here. Ah. Is it going that way? No. Let's go. Ah. Oh. My Bambi was up myself. Heck yeah, it was up there, we've got to go. Come on, then. chase me, chase me, chase me, chase me. Or her! <laughs> Uh oh. That could have gone wrong very quickly. It could have. Hello, Evelyn. 4 p.m. There is super early for us Americans. Is it? I thought you guys were only behind a couple of hours. I think the. Uh, oh, is it like fucking 9 a.m. where you are? I think have you the, just woken up? I think the East Coast is behind by four hours, but oh. it gets further and it's further. Fucking lunchtime. You haven't even had your sandwiches, and you're like, oh, now all this. You know? <laughs> I'm not sure how far behind the last coast is, but yeah. Yeah. Well, we've got our weird bots too. I don't know if you can see in the chat there. I don't know what the fuck that is. Do you? Do your other streamers get that too? What's that? Like the other people you watch. Because if so, then we can stop yeah, worrying. You, you sneaky the audio is fine. Lovely. I'll catch, I'll catch you. you. <laughs> That's so what he sounds like. Fun of him. He just, he, he's really like oh. just. <laughs> Anyway, um, I keep losing track of where the fuck I'm going. Like, do it this way. <gasps> okay. No. <sighs> oh, it's over there. Okay. We're doing stealth, by the way. It's a kid's stealth game, so don't expect it to be, like, fucking... I don't know. Um, well, Metal Gear Solid, I guess, is the best example. <gasps> 
It's not going to be anything like that. We don't have rations or cigarettes or C4 or anything like that. Oh, cardboard boxes. Yeah, cardboard box. That's the most obvious one. I should have thought about that. I know. Um, okay, we have to actually go back up there now. Okay. Skills. Skills. That's Filch, by the way. Um, I don't know how familiar you are with Harry Potter, but you know that's Filch, played infamously by David Bradley in the movies, aka the first Doctor, when it's not William Hartnell. Skyrim. <laughs> I don't know Skyrim stock system. Like I said, I barely got out of the cave when I failed. <laughs> Kind of mental that I do. I did like all those Dungeons and Dragons games, you know, like um, Baldur's Gate, and all, but I never bothered with Skyrim that much. You would think that'd be right up my street. You played a blue. Kind of you played a blue. Yeah. Uh, I think oh. Morrowind is the one I played. I think Oblivion I, I kind of skipped on, and then Skyrim I kind of played for like an hour at a mate's house. And that's that's that. I don't know. Hitman's uh, stealth system from Absolution is is a bit naff because uh. it doesn't work. Because you just when you put a disguise on, everybody who's wearing the same shit as you is gonna be like, "Hey, you're supposed to be that guy, that Frank. You, you're supposed to look. You, your face is different." And it's like, come on, like fuck, you're gonna remember the face of every employee you work with. But yeah, somehow that's how the disguise system works. Uh. Oh, so you don't... Yeah, okay. You're not even a Harry Potter fan. Okay. Um... Well, normally I'd ask why, why, what, why are you watching us then, but I guess we're just that funny and good and amazing and, and, and all that good stuff. I'm hoping. Otherwise, I'm going to have an existential crisis. Um, we're not like a Harry Potter channel. We'll, we'll play other stuff. We'll... We're gonna probably at some point get around to like figuring out how to react to things. Not not so much like boring like music videos and stuff, more like right wing YouTubers so we can rip them apart. <laughs> you know, when we get when we figure out how to do that. One day, it's a possibility. Ah, okay. Never mind. You so nearly Saved by it. the life. What the fuck? Well, it's good that the game don't matter because uh, we're kind of done with this game today. Um, this is it. I'm thinking of maybe make playing it every now and again, like, for, like, you know, once every other year maybe. But um, we've got plenty planned. Loads of other old games, new games. We've got a um, Monopoly that we're both going to play someday on the internet. That'd be fun. We can make that like a monthly thing. A monthly Monopoly to tournament or whatever. <laughs> Monopoly makes us into right evil bastards. It does. Though. It does. You want to see me be a right prick to, to Dion? You, We're you, you both like super competitive people, so when we play games like Monopoly, yeah, it you, gets... You thought I was cruel yesterday. It gets vicious. I turn into a cruel bastard with Monopoly. I... I, I turn into Ugh. like fucking Bezos on steroids. Feeling the communism leaves my body. <laughs> Card. I know what you're thinking. Why the fuck did you jump down there? Card. Um, Card is. Card is why I. I down wasn't there. questioning you. That's yeah. All. Exactly. You prick. Ugh. Who the fuck is I making that noise? <laughs> uh, it's the neighbors. No idea. What's I hope we don't get no carolers, you know, just coming up. Then like, again. La, 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 and I'm like, fuck off! I mean, it is Christmas Eve. Actually, Busy! So I understand that the neighbours. Your little be... fucking cherub bastards. Like, I understand the neighbours going around today. The kids are all excited for their presents and shit, you know. It's gonna be even worse in the morning. Uh, is it? 
Oh, oh yeah, because I'll be running around with, be their, running around with their, their fucking present. remote control cars and their fucking scooters. What was it? Like, last? Uh, yeah, last fucking... year they got, like, a ride-on toy for one of the kids and they were just, like, you could just hear it scraping across the ceiling. It was mental. Yeah, Monopoly does. It turns people into capitalists. But, yeah, it's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. Um, I mean, normally we... Um, we have. To, I'm, I'm like a Monopoly board collector, pretty much. I, I get, I've got Doctor Who, I've got Simpsons, I've got Pokemon, I've got fucking the normal one. I've got a proper old retro one too from the 60s. So, um, but unfortunately, the only one we can play on a computer. I've already done that. Um, is is the standard Monopoly. So, uh, I need to get my bearings because I'm completely lost. Is it this way? Yeah, I think so. Um, but yeah, but that doesn't mean it'll be bad because it's Monopoly, you know, it all plays the same. Um, I believe this is it. And we'll be able to completely scalp each other on it. <laughs> um, and you guys can place bets. We'll have like a thing where like whoever wins, if, if you like make like a, a bet on who's going to win and, and, and that actually happens, we can give perks and stuff, you know, like you get to pick the next game or whatever, you know. If we have it, mind you, because we can't play every single game imaginable. Um, but we'll see what we can do. We could even possibly have it so that, like, um, we can add like a third, a third character into the game, and then like um, someone in chat can just give us commands on what they want that to do. So, and effectively, um, you'd be playing it with us, basically. You know, you'd be like, oh yeah, I want to make a deal here, I want to like, ro just roll the dice there. And, you know, you might win. You might beat us. Despite the fact you're not even in the fucking same country. <laughs> it's going to be great. Uh, it's just an idea, anyway. And it'll be probably the first time we'll be able to play competitively on a game, because the rest of the games we have are all um, either not competitive or single player. So, and look at that, we're right in front, oh, oh, fuck off, fuck off, don't you, I think he's gonna like turn that way, there we go, you creepy bastard, can, can we, ah, oh, fuck off, fuck off, fuck, 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 ah, did we just, <laughs> did we just get rid of him? Did you break him? I think he Did thought he... No one gets he fall, this he fell down. makes a fool of him. Oh, yeah, nice one, mate. You, you're, you're in the fucking trash. Don't you fucking... <laughs> oh, you broke it. Oh. <laughs> Bollocks. So I've been caught, and he's just going to do the animation forever. I don't know. Go into the menu and exit if you can and see if it fixes it. Is it... No, we're gonna have to reboost. <laughs> that would have been funny though if you'd uh, like got filled trapped and you could just go through the yeah, like, rest of this. I thought him. we did like a thing where he just fell off into the abyss and we were like, right, let's go up that tower. I fucking hope we don't have to do like a shitload again. I don't remember where your last save was. That was a fun epic gamer moment. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I have a feeling we're right at the beginning again. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, no, we're, oh, okay. we're a bit, I don't know. Oh no, actually we're right fucking near this. You still gotta do some parkour again. But... Parkour, 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 what? Yeah, that was that would have been a pro gamer move. Just it would have been like you know. Um, Hang on, did it already count as you unlocking that secret area before? I wouldn't fucking know, would I? Um, the door's closed, and I've got the wizard card, so I'm gonna assume yes. Oh. But I wouldn't know. I don't think it gives you perfect stats. It is a kids' game, so you can't really expect it to give you all the you know, the nitty gritty. Which is unfortunate because I'd love to know. <laughs> my actual death count. <laughs> How many times I've actually died? It's definitely more than last time. 
Right, I'm just gonna stay still, because <laughs> otherwise he's gonna like start walking towards me. Right. I think I'm allowed to turn. I just wanna see if there is anything that way. No, I think we can just make a straight line to there once he's passed. so slowly yeah the visuals are laggy because the game is lagging <laughs> we yeah the frame rate is that bad generally uh, it has moments where it's fine but yeah it doesn't like light fire water stuff like that um choppy Yeah, it's, it's trapping a bit, naturally. Unless you mean like it's blurred. If it's blurry, then it doesn't look blurry from what I'm seeing. But but yeah, if you if you see the frame rate drop in, that's not OBS. That's the game. That's the tower we need to get up to to uh, to get the dragon back. By the way, where's Harry got the dragon? We assume it's under his cloak somewhere, but like... How can you do epic parkour with a fucking dragon under your cloak? That's what I want to know. True. Also, wouldn't that dragon be making weird fucking noises? You'd be trying to stay quiet and the thing would be like... Nyeh, nyeh. You'd be like, shut the fuck up. You would think. I'm trying to get past a fucking janitor here. <laughs> oh, this ain't the end of it, though. We've got Filch and his do fucking cat. you think cat. I'm blind? To deal I'm with. not letting anyone into that yes. tower tonight. Yeah, you're gonna let me into the tower, and we've got, um, like, um, you know how they they say that like enemies become friends, friends become enemies. Uh, we're about to have like a an old friend <laughs> help us out. <laughs> okay, yeah, it's choppy as fuck. It's taking like an entire minute just for him to like wave his head up and down. Okay, we get it. Mm. Anyway, it's Christmas Eve. Is everyone excited? Oh yeah, you, you don't really do Christmas. Oh, I'm excited. Uh, well, we are. We, we've we got uh, Pokemon and, and stuff and, and we're making a trifle. Well, Dion is anyway. I've I'm gonna help by consuming it. That's my that's my job. I don't think Americans have trifle. I think that's a trifle. British, I, think I don't know if they call thing. it something else. Try it's uh, what is trifle? Go on, Diana. All right, so you've got like a layer of jelly with sponge fingers in it, and then it's a layer of custard, and then it's a layer of cream, and then any toppings you want to put on top of it. That's trifle. Yeah. Trifle's good, and um, we're having a roast. Um, Obviously. I don't know if you guys also have roast if you call it the same thing Christmas dinner um <laughs> hey Graham Linehan to the rescue Peeves you'll be banished for this right right here is a uh, our chance oh no no he, he walks back to the that thing that could come in handy if I have to distract Filch along the way yeah he, he just does that as a thingy um, what was I saying? Yeah, roast. Um, it's just roast potatoes, Yorkshire pudding, carrots, peas, gravy, you know, that kind of stuff. Bit of bacon, if you eat meat. Uh, Dion's a vegetarian, I'm not, so. Yeah, apparently, yeah. yeah um, she's a bit of a trifle before. Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> And by rights, he should have seen me then, but whatever. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm pretty sure you'd do well. Now that I think about it, we have, like, two different desserts to eat tomorrow. Because we have the Yule uh, It's Christmas. <laughs> but I, I didn't want to live forever anyway. Fuck it. <laughs> anyway, uh, Skybox is wonderful. Look at that. Look at that, the moon and everything. Like... 
Obviously, the moon was blown into two pieces in Sonic Adventure 2, but here it is. This proves that this game takes place before the events of Sonic Adventure 2. Otherwise, the moon would be in two bits. So, so yeah. That wasn't funny. It fucking was. It's funny if I say it is. That's how the world works. <laughs> I can't wait until we get to play Sonic Adventure 2 on stream. I'm, I know that game back to front. Um, obviously, it's one of those games where sometimes it doesn't go purely to your plan, but I'm pretty good. Mm. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, but I'm glad that your mum's okay, relatively speaking. Um, I'm not sure what to say about that, to be honest. It's, um, I don't know, what, what can you say? I don't, I don't really know. Awkward, yeah, you know? Yeah, I mean, it's just... I don't want to say the wrong thing, I don't want to piss anyone off. It's just one of those, it's, you know, much more speedy recovery. Yeah. I'm sure she'll be back on her feet in no time. Long ass loading screen for doing that. Yeah. And now we've got it like twice as hard because now we've got like a fucking cat. Bilch and his cat. Yeah. This is nice. We ever get another cat on I just, I, think it's a cu I just think it's a cute name. It is, but like, I thought we made a role to not have Harry Potter too, too much in our lives, you know? Like, okay, well, we'll just call her Norris. I thought we made the rule that we were going to keep our old stuff, but we weren't going to, like, start naming pets after their characters. Yeah, recovery is a long and hard process, but you know what? Um, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Obviously barring certain illnesses you know like polio but you know for the most part you know um, I've got an auntie who um, survived breast cancer twice um, she's in her mid 90s I think and she's still around last I checked so she's made of tough stuff I don't know if she made a deal with the devil or not but but <laughs> Christ she's a tough one I think death's just kind of given up really you know every time he comes into the kitchen she's like I'm making a cup of tea be with you in five, all right? And by the time she's finished making a cup of tea, death has gotten bored and walked off. So, <laughs> Mrs. Norris, I could have sworn I heard footsteps in here, but yeah, blah. Let's check the library, my sweet. Have we been in the library the entire fucking time? It's one big ass library. I was gonna say yeah, it's a huge library. That fucking cat can smell you from like halfway across the room. I told you, she can see you through the cloak. Mm. Speaking of which, Dion um, won't be here for all of tonight. Um, she's got work to do as well. Um, SKE training and whatnot. I'm really the only person who's got a break this Christmas, to be honest, completely free. Yeah, my mum's um, like, working today. Yeah, she's working today. Yeah, she's working today. I'm gonna call her when she gets home. Mm. Yeah, I don't know. My, my auntie is... Uh, she doesn't age either. She, she looks the same as when I was a young lad. But, you know, when I was a young boy. Um, she's not changed. Aha! Uh -huh. I've heard you for sure this yeah. time. Quick, Mrs. Norris. You keep watch from above. Right. This is gonna cry. <laughs> Look at the fucking. Did your father take you into the city to see a marching band? No, my, my father beat me up for six years straight. Rip. Instead. You'll not get past me now, you rotten little gutter snipes. What doesn't kill you permanently traumatizes you and gives you a weird sense All right. of humor. I was trying to be nice, okay? <laughs> I know I, the world is not nice, okay? Just shit happens, but 
What I'm trying to say is, like, some people are just made of tough stuff and it's going to take a little more than fucking leg surgery to, to take people out, you know? Like, something tells me that, especially mothers, they, they don't. It's going to take a fucking lot to take them down. Whoa! Big ass jump. Um, there's the fucking cat. And that cat can jump. Check this out. Check this out, right? Fucking yes, mate. And then we have to back the fuck up. And this is the scary bit, because it's like, it's... Because if you move a muscle, she's like... <laughs> she smells you. But if you don't move... Sometimes the cat will just turn back around and like I'm gonna do this bit again. Yeah. <laughs> like. Uh oh. Uh oh. No, we're all right. We're all right. Um, that's a bit of a tough jump to make if you can't see the ground. Oh, fuck. Can that's the way we came in, ain't it? Yeah, we don't need to go back that way. This is a nice little room, in it? Oh, yep, you hear werewolves, um, despite the fact that they're in the library at night. Yeah. Um, it's, a, it's a castle. Also, there's loads of frogs. It's just basically night sounds, where there shouldn't be night sounds. Because it's it makes the, the, it sounds like you're outside at night. But you're, you're indoors, so it shouldn't be making those noises. It should be, like, silent as fuck. Basically. No, you dickhead. Wrong fucking time to be doing that. <laughs> uh, save point. Nice. Intruder! Oh. Yes. <laughs> Tell you what, you guys are gonna laugh at me later because I've gotta play like a sort of like a miniature chess mini game in this game. Because there's that bit where you gotta do the wizard's chess bit. Um and I always fucking suck at it because it appears to have different rules to actual chess, which I know how to play actual chess. But um, for some reason, the little mini game kind yeah. of simplified it so much for kids that it's it you. becomes confusing and again. When I do, you so regret it. The pieces just seem to go wherever the fuck they like. You make your move, and then and then you just get like, okay, so the bishop is now going straight forward. Okay, then, <laughs> like, it just makes no sense because obviously bishops are supposed to go diagonally, and the horses are supposed to do like a, an L shape. But they don't. They just go wherever the fuck they like. So it's more like playing drafts. Hello again, Harry. I think this is the last time we'll collecting? see him in this game. Fred and George are up to their usual tricks, I presume. Yep, Fred and George are definitely. Up to I their heard usual about your tricks. Quidditch victory. Yes, well done, Harry. On to the cuppy, what? Uh, what? That's probably the most British you'll you'll hear this game as well. A what? To be fair, what, what? nearly headless Nick in the films also has like a really good British accent. Yeah, he's drunk. He's drunk, Lise, isn't he? Yeah. Drunk Lise is a dick, by the way. Oh he's, yeah. I I admire him as an actor, but he, he just he just feels like everything's a threat to him these days, doesn't he? Just. Mm. Have you seen all the people? Oh, on these the kids with their blue hair. How Have dare you seen they? all the people on the internet? Uh, there's a gingerbread cookie. Uh, it was found in, in like a in like a coffee shop or Starbucks or something maybe in America and it's gone fucking viral because a bunch of conservatives are crying about the fact that it was labelled gingerbread person instead of gingerbread man it's just 
weird. It's it it's they they take the bait so easily. Yeah, and, and then they tell us where the trigger like. Yeah, they call us like snowflakes. So, and softy shit. snowflakes, and it's they're like pure projection, honestly. Yeah, it's bullshit. Like you're saying with Potato Head, that that Mr. Potato Head thing. Yeah. Like. It's like they never said. They it. they're still selling Mr. Potato Head. Yeah. They're just all they're doing is they're selling like a new offshoot called. I don't know, but it's I, either way. They've not taken any products off the shelves. It's they're still selling the same stuff. Yeah, they're still selling. They're just the, putting more out. That's they're all still they're selling doing. the same shit. It's just they rebranded the brand to be just potato. Same head. with those Doctor Sears books. Like everyone's saying, oh, they're banned. We're never going to see them again. And then on eBay, you see them being sold for like hundreds and hundreds because they're now banned. It's bullshit. Like I go to my charity shop. I see those banned books all the time, sold for like fifty p. They're not rare. And they're not really that special, to be honest. We're just lucky that the books they did ban for for Doctor Seuss were the crap ones. Like they're not they're not Cat in the Hat. You know they're not fucking. Um, I can't I can't remember any others actually, but but it's just that those the, the ones like Mulberry Street or whatever. Like personally, I don't I don't really get the point because it's those weren't the ones I remember. Intruder! Really. Intruder! Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe, maybe this. Can you shut up? <laughs> Maybe there's um, those books are special to some people, but um, even so, if you want ah. those books so badly, um, <laughs> you can to. find them. They're they're so easy to find. They haven't just dropped off the earth just because they um, they've been pointed out to be a little bit problematic. And that's the thing, though, right? You people can still buy them. Like conservatives ah. were wording it as if oh. These books are banned. They're all going to be thrown on a fire. When really, what really happened was no, they've, anything, just, they've just stopped producing them. If anyone loves burning books, it's fucking conservatives. Mm. Really, all they've done is said we're not going to produce these books anymore. That's all. They, that's all they said. We're not going to sell these books anymore. Yeah. It's not that they were going to round up people for owning a fucking copy of the book. And but it, 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 it does mean for the next like fifty years or whatever, you're still going to be able to find them. They'll be everywhere. Yeah, it's just. Stupid. Like, and they will probably reprint them at some point. Huh? They'll probably get over themselves, and they'll realise that they they're good books, and then they'll just take out the bits that are like a little bit more, you know. But yeah, no. Um, they'll change some of the wording and like some of the skin colours, if you know what I mean. Uh, oh, okay, I keep fucking that bit up because the lag kind of fucks my drum up. But yeah, no. As for the gingerbread cookie thing, it went viral because it was a conservative person. I can't remember. They're verified on Twitter, uh. so they're like a. Apparently, some big yeah, shock. I'm not very cry. good at talking about this kind of stuff because I always get my words wrong. Yeah, there's but. some big shock cry, baby. But yeah, uh, they yeah. posted a picture of it with the caption or with the tweet saying, The world's gone mad. I'm like, It's a cookie, bro. Yeah, political correctness gone mad. It's a cookie, bro. I'm more concerned about how much the cookie cost. It was like $2.80 for a cookie. Well, <gasps> they're always going on about freedom of speech. Um, but it seems freedom of expression to them is like really bad. Like, how dare they have blue hair? And, and choose to identify as something other than male or female. It's like, I thought you guys were all about freedom of expression and, and movement and, and speech. Or is it just you want freedom from consequences of your speech? That's, That's what, what they, they want. want. Yeah. <laughs> so basically, um, they can say what they want and get away with it. But God forbid I bring up the fact that I don't want to be thought of as male for the rest of the yeah. you know, They just yeah. want to be able to say the N word and not lose yeah. their jobs because of it. Yeah, it's Intruder. all silly. Intruder in the forbidden corridor. Uh, fuck you. I go where I want. I, I go where I want. Yeah, the gays the gays the gays do what they want. <laughs> the gays can do whatever they want. Who was that? I was talking to you recently about I was talking to some other queer friends I can't about fucking how see, um, like we joke about things that we don't like as being homophobic. Oh, oh, good. Hell, that was close. <gasps> oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh dear! Oh fuck! Get bored and move away. No. Yeah, it's gonna see me. It's. it's I, I saw him coming. Her coming. Whatever. Genderless cat. Whatever. Yeah, do you know what? Have you noticed that, though? Like, if someone comes up to you and you've got your dog and they say, Oh, isn't he handsome? And you say, actually, it's a girl. They'll instantly be like, Oh, but isn't she lovely? And I'm like, okay, but why can't you do that for people? Um, they don't mind animals having rights, I guess, because they don't care about the animals. 
for humans though it's sort of like this big power play i think they do it they do it with babies though. like if someone if someone has like a baby with a penis and they this, call it a boy this reminds me of that time just after the afghanistan thing went on and and you had some like people basically saying that like the lives of some dogs somewhere were, were more important than the lives of like children and um I mean, I'm not saying I hate Afghanistan's dogs. I, I would like everyone to be... It would have been cool if there was room for everybody, but... I mean... Personally, I'd, 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 I, would, I, I think the kids would have been more important. And uh, I'm going to get the fuck over here. But yeah, no, I mean, like, even if it's like, if you've got, like, your infant child, because, you know... And, like, if you say that your child is, like, a boy because it was born with a penis or whatever and someone comes up to your child saying oh your little girl is so cute and you say actually it's my son that person will instantly be like oh I'm so sorry it's like they do it for babies but not for drug trans I must have been but I'm not going back yeah fuck it never look back <laughs> it's and when funny because I do, as soon as you regret it freedom of speech goes away yeah true because uh, being nice to people that are different from you is a novel concept yeah <laughs> We always end up talking about this kind of stuff, don't we? Yeah, it's just the way we're inclined. And it's my fault. They'll I've... say that we're obsessed. We're like, oh, you left us. We talk about nothing else. It's my right. fault. I brought we up. Talk the about a lot of other it's stuff. It's my fault. I brought up the gingerbread cookie that they're all crossed about. Yeah. Imagine being triggered by a cookie. Anyway, I think we're about to uh, be our power set, and I'm pretty sure most people know this, but power is the it's desire backwards, so this is. Wow. I don't know. JK's weird, fake, deep bullshit, probably. I don't know. But yeah. When I was a kid, I was like, oh, Erised. And then I got older and realised that it was just desire backwards. Uh, da -da -da -da. Let's go and see Mommy and Daddy. Reflected in the mirror of Erised were Harry's parents, James and Lily Potter. Harry stared hungrily back as though hoping to fall right through the glass and reach them. He was startled when a voice sounded behind him. Harry turned slowly about. So you, like hundreds before you, have discovered the delights of the mirror of Erised. Because in the film, he ends up taking it away. He went on to explain that or nothing less than the deepest, most desperate desire of our hearts. But that it would give neither knowledge nor truth. The mirror of Erised will be moved to a new home shortly, Dumbledore went on, adding ominously that if Harry ever came across it again, he would be prepared. Mm. But prepared for what? See, in the film, Thought Dumbledore Harry. was like, no, don't go looking for it again. You will die. You will get killed. You, you, you young kid. Big parent stuff. Don't go looking for a mirror. And then here he's like, uh, I bet you can't beat your high score though, can you? <laughs> he's just like, he'll be prepared. Go on, try it. What's Harry supposed to think? And um, we only have a bit more Filthy of the... Filthy whelps gave us the slip, Mrs. Norris. <laughs> Filthy whelps. I've locked the only door out of here for the sake of That does sound a bit dirty, doesn't it? Stay here and watch the library for a bit, my dear. Oh, it's going at like one frame a second again. Oh, no. This is like the slowest petting of a cat you'll ever see. That cat is there for it. He's enjoying it. If I pet She's Suki that it. slow, she'd get bored as fuck and walk off. Ow. Hmm? I said if I pet Suki that slowly, she'd get bored as fuck and walk off. Oh, yeah, yeah, we got a cat. Yes, we know. We know. We know. Uh, we got the music from the herbology suite. Nice. It wouldn't. It wouldn't make you it assigned female at birth, but it would make you look like you were. Like it said, it doesn't give you truth or knowledge. It would give you simply what you desire. Which, yes, you would look like a the most beautiful woman you could ever want to look like. Um, but I don't think it would like change your genitals magically or whatever it doesn't do that um well it certainly bring, didn't bring harry's parents back from the dead that's for sure no yeah it didn't do that 
don't know. Uh, just a reminder though, if you're going to get into Harry Potter stuff, um, the creator of Harry Potter is a notorious turf. She is like queen of the turfs. She really is. So, really um, is. so I would advise going second-hand route if you're going to read the books or watch the movies or. Hell, you, know. you can pick up like a lot of stuff. Because it's one thing. <laughs> it's one thing when like um, you know, random Joe Blogs buys Harry Potter stuff. It's quite another when we as trans people fund her. While she's uh, throwing all the hatred out there. Yeah, you and I had a big talk about this. Yeah, I've done it. I, I've, I really wanted uh, some. Um, they started releasing ones with um, bookmarks, and I really wanted a collection of them. And uh, so far, we've managed to get them without paying JK directly. But we did get fucking close. I saw him in Asda, and I really wanted them. Um. And there was the debacle recently with the sticker album. Hey Tess. You excited for Christmas? Crimbo! This okay, should be a secret area. I think it is, but it's in a cutscene, so we right. will just ignore that. I'm just gonna put it back. Okay. And um, we have this big area, this room that has lights and stuff in the to... It's notoriously buggy though, it's broken on me numerous times. Basically just a case of walking to one uh -huh. side of the room, hitting a switch or a lever, going to the other side and in the meantime avoiding the cat. And I remember there's a troll as well, for some reason. Uh -huh. I don't know if they stick on the They come down. Hey, you know, a kid your age should be excited about Christmas. Only way out of this room. Uh, you're really just saw no, I guess. You take that side of the room, and I'll take this one. We'll catch you, Mrs. Norris. Intruder! I'll be able to start talking again once the strange noises stop. Uh, we want that bean. That bean near the window. Get that bean. I'm gonna get that oh. bean. Oh. oh, okay. Oh. We're still in the game. We're still in the game. Oh, oh, oh. shit. No. Oh. We got the bean. Pro Strats Gamer. Okay, so we've got to avoid fish. And the cat. Uh, oh, shit. Shit. Bollocks. Wank on a stick. Oh, uh, that's what happens when you get caught by the cat. It fucking hisses at you. And then you just do the armpit thing. What armpit thing? He, Harry, when he gets caught by the cat, he just kind of... Yeah, he, he just rubbing his... Like he just shat himself in class or something. Like. Yeah. <laughs> We've got to get that bean again, probably. Getting there's fine, it's just getting back. I, I fell off the um I didn't quite reach the beam and then I fell down and the cat was like, Yeah, I got you. Oh, I've got a hair out of place. <laughs> you do. <laughs> we must go and find the people who did this and take vengeance. We must inform the church. If I find a hair out of place, I'm gonna come and find you. Yeah, we really need Uh, I thought that's just how they are, isn't it? They're always a bit dim. Yeah, they were way brighter when we first turned them on. I don't know how I feel about... Okay. Uh, well, I mean, I, I'm in a different position to you, Evelyn, because I, I, I was born at just the right time to become a massive Harry Potter fan as a child. Um, so I kind of, long before JK was uh, a turf, I, I was a big fan of all of it. I loved it all. Um, I had all those old VHSs, I had the original sticker album from way back. 
I collected those lenticular wizard cards. They even released 30 buck beans. They, they had them as sweets back then, and I, I, I used to have them. Um, and uh, these days I find it hard to leave all that behind because it's a very big part of my childhood. Um, yeah, Dion just kind of threw it all at me and said, you know what, I'm sick of all this. So now I've got it. And I'm not going to get rid of any of it because it's my childhood. Um, JK Rowling might have taken my womanhood, but she's not going to take my childhood. <laughs> you know? So, um, but that said, I just I try not to, to fond her directly. So, I don't really buy anything else. Out of this room is past that gate. He makes an awful racket. You take that side of the room, and I'll take this one. But you're in a different position, really, because you're brand new to it all, I guess. So if you started collecting, you'd have a... Intruder! You'd have a lot of stuff you'd have to... I, I don't know, Evelyn. Because um, I'm only seeing what messages pop up. Um... I did get the one you just sent about some of the messages not possibly popping up. Uh, I don't know, you, you said, uh, oh I know, I'm no fan of her, that'd be JK. Um, and then I don't know how I feel about that, I assume that was about Harry Potter 2. And then your last message, so I don't know if that checks out. Um, be honest, it's, it's just you and Tess, so if you want to spam, go right ahead, you know, like, if you just think it's not getting through. Um, very sorry about that, though. I, I can't do much because I'm playing a game currently, but I can have a look at the settings afterwards. I might have some weird, like, filter on or something that's stopping you from... Um, I doubt it, though, because I don't really change settings. I, I tend to just let people say what they want in chat, unless they're being, like, incredibly offensive. Fuck off. Cat made weird noise. I'm missing a message. Uh, it seems so, if you've... Oh. Um, are you sure it's not your Wi-Fi or anything? Um, not that I want to blame you or anything, it's just that it could be a number of factors. You know? oh. um, the game sometimes soft locks here. Like, um, I'll just refuse to like open the door at the end. We'll see then. Um, Harry Potter is Harry Potter. I don't know. I mean, um, granted, if you do get into it, you've not really got much. There's like, it's not like fucking anime or fucking Power Rangers, I guess. Pokemon, yeah. You, you don't have to collect like tons of cards and books and. There's not like multiple TV shows. Intruder! Intruder! In the Forbidden Corridor! Yeah, I have a feeling, uh, Evelyn, that it's your internet, because um, everyone else can't see the message either. So, because um, normally that would just be a problem that we'd have on our end, but it seems it's a problem for everybody. Um, oh, bollocks, I'm being chased. I'm being chased. Can I escape? the might of Filch. It seems you can outrun him. You can outrun Filch. Didn't know that. Um, but yeah, Harry Potter wise, you've got like, I don't know, uh, seven books. Um, eight films, because uh, the Deathly Hallows was split into two films. They all should have been split into two films. Definitely the last three books, I think, should have been, yeah. Um, and then you've got a bunch of other shit. Wands, um, just toys, you know, like, you know. It's not like Pokemon where you've got like thousands and thousands of cards or anime where you've got like season 1236 of Dragon Ball or whatever. It's not exactly got a huge history. Yeah, good. Because um, honestly, I don't think you'd enjoy it, really, because you you haven't really got a nostalgic link like I do, so I don't think you'd get much from it. Um, it's a shame when one of your heroes just kind of 
ruins everything for you, so you can't enjoy the thing that got you through your childhood. Uh, but it happens, you know, there's bands, there's um, certain bands, yeah, like I, I really used to like the music of uh, Mindless self Indulgence. We recently found out that James Uringer is a bit otherwise known as Jimmy Uringer. I'll carry this on once the glitch is stopped. Turns out the singer of Manus Half Indulgence has um, got a bit of a history with like underage fans, should we say? Um, and that's not good because it makes listening to music a lot harder. Um, Marilyn Manson's also been having a bit of a tough year. Um, it's, it's been proven that he's been involved in some shady stuff. And I used to love Marilyn when I was a kid. Uh, Edgy, you know. I was a big rebel. Went through a bit of a goth phase. Um. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Where did that come from? It's the Pepsi. Oh, I was going to say. Have you taken another one of my raspberries? No, no. I mean, you can. Just tell me first. I'm trying to keep tabs. Um. I don't know. As everyone knows, I'm a, I'm, I've got my big four, really. Um. Harry Potter is sort of like the least of the four, but it is one. Um, but I love Power Rangers. I love. I'm a big James Bond fan. I love Bond. Do you, I don't know. America is kind of like that with Bond, aren't they? They're just like sometimes they get really into it. At the times, it's more of a British come thing. Out wherever you are. I like Bond. And yeah, Bond is problematic, but you have to remember it came from the 60s, so you know you, you take the rough with the smooth. You know you condone it. You don't support it, you can do on it. Not really a massive fan of the Sean Connery era myself anyway. I, I jumped on really from like Roger Moore onwards. Because um, all those films were on the TV when I was young at Christmas. And I still remember seeing Moonraker when I was like six. It's like a Christmas film to watch tomorrow actually. We still have them. Oh. Okay, everyone place your bets in chat. Christmas films. I've got Scrooged. Um, but Dion hated that one. But yeah, I we like already it. watched it. So. Music's different to me because I can just listen to it for free, mostly. Yeah, streaming streaming's a thing. I, I prefer physical music myself. I like putting a record on and absorbing it. Um, nothing wrong with streaming, though. Uh, it's just the way the world's going. I stream music. Yeah, yeah, there's there's lots of bands lately where you find out the singer's an absolute knobhead. But there we go. Or at least one of the members. Yeah. I don't know. There's still a lot of love. I don't know. Do you like against me, Evelyn? Um, Peeves, you'll be banished. Somewhat ironically, this. actually, um, the singer of Against Me is a trans woman and has a daughter that is that is called Evelyn. So, um, there's a there's a nice one for you. You're not the only. Um, person called Evelyn. Well, you wouldn't, of course, be the only person in the world called Evelyn, but, um, you know. Uh, Laura Jane Grace is the singer's name. Um, came out in 2014. Um, presumably, they've been feeling that way for decades, probably. Um, and they write really good music. I'm, I'm not just saying get into them just because they're trans, because, you know, that's, that's not really a good reason to get into anything, let's be honest. You get into things because they're good, not because of the the, the, the attributes of the person creating the art. Um, but it's genuinely good music if you're into like punk, you know. Like, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, the cats are chasing us. Meow. <laughs> they said they've listened to a bit of their stuff. Against me, yeah, it's good stuff. Potatoes, rice, and bread is a is a good tune. Um, trans for, uh, transgender dysphoria blues. Um, is it? Break it down. The one, the one about the black rings. You know. I want to piss on the walls of your house. That song. Trying to drop those brass rings off your fat fucking fingers. Yeah. 
It's a song. It's a song about tearing down people who think they're better than you. I don't really listen to a lot of mainstream music. Oh, um, uh, yeah, Tess. Um, he listens to video I'm games. I'm pretty sure when you get a bit older, you'll you might have, you know. I mean, nah, by the time I was 16, I was way into, like, Maiden and Black Sabbath and Judas Priest and all that. Um, we're about to find out the Bean situation. Um, but yeah, no, there's nothing wrong with being into, like, anime music, you know? It's, it's good music, you know? It means you, you may, you know, you probably like classical, you know? Because a lot of the um, scores written for, like, films and animes are, are usually classical. And the Japanese know how to do classical music. They're, they're really good at it. It's VGM, yeah. It's video game music. I've got some classics. I, I love um, that, you know, Mass Effect? When you go into the galaxy map and it's got that really sweet tune, the galaxy theme. I love that. Um, I did a video on the channel um, about like my 15, top 15 favorite like tunes that I've heard in video games. and. I had all sorts in there. There was like the Halo theme, um, that theme from Doom, you know, the. It's good stuff. I do love 100 Gex. Yeah, I love Hyper Pop. Hyper Pop's great. Charlie XCX, fucking Dorian. What's his name again? King Dorian, is it? Dorian Electra. Dorian, Dorian. Dorian Electra, yeah, he's great. <laughs> Thierry, the only songs that caught on were whatever Dion would play years ago. <laughs> yeah. Laura Less. Oh, and Sophie, yeah, there's another one. R.I.P. Um, I'm going to have to check out Laura Less then, because I've not heard that one. Yeah. You learn something new every day, don't you, from chat? You might have just got me into my new favourite artist. Yeah, you're Double gonna. <laughs> I, I also listen to a lot of K-pop and Dion fucking hates it. Um, I don't know if it's just because it's all like very, very sort of plastic and manufactured, or if it's just because most of the songs do sound kind of the same. It's a mix of both, I really. Don't know, but um, she doesn't like it. They don't like it. I'm more of a if, if you're hey, going Harry, that way, I'm more of a J. Do you have 25 person. beans for us? Like they need, like they need more beans. Like, look at the fucking. Ah. Fuck you, fuck you, ah. you known piece That's of shit. It. That's all the beans we need. Sorry. Thanks, Harry. We could have done it. Oh, Laura Lazzi is part of 100 Gex. I think I've it. seen her then. You miss shit with Is she the extra squeaky Thanks, one Harry. that wears the um the we really skirt? Needed these. Remember, if, if you know 100 gags, you'll know what I'm going to say. It'll be our secret, right? Yeah, there's, there's a blonde on, George. one. And We've got work to do. Mostly from what I remember, the, the more high... Like, the, the vocals that are way up there in the in the register, you know, because they pitch shift a lot of the stuff. Um, that's usually the, um, the more feminine one doing that. As far as I know, um... Laura, um, the, the blonde one from Andrew Gex, is actually trans. I mean, I don't know because I don't do research on that kind of stuff, but I'm pretty sure I remember an interview where it was like between her and um, fucking Fantano, uh, Needle Drop, Anthony Fantano, you know, because he interviews a lot of that kind of stuff. Yeah, hey, fuck you, Dion. K-pop is great. Yeah. I don't know. I. Yeah, yeah. I'm just not. I know. Um, we we both. I'm sure Evelyn knows about how like K-pop is made and and uh, how tough the industry is and and how it chews people up. But it's good music. I didn't, I mean, I like I said, if I'm going that way, I'm more of a J-Rock person than a K-Pop or a J-Pop person. It's just how it is. I, I like a bit of J-Rock, too. I've, I've heard a bit of the Gazette, Maximum the Hormone. All oh, like the Gazette. Oh. Yeah, okay. But we're, you know, K-Pop. Yeah, no, I... Fuck you. I don't, I just, orange Caramel. I'm just not a pop person that do, much. Do you like, like Orange I Caramel, just, I don't Evelyn? listen to much Western pop either. I loved Orange Caramel. They were my, they were my main. They were my... What's the term? Is it Stan like group? K pop has terminology. And my bias is um I f 
I, I tell you what, a bias she is. I forget her name. Um, it wasn't Lizzie. Um, I like Lizzie, but it wasn't Lizzie. It was. That's gonna bother me. I can't remember the name. It's been a while. The more you think about it, the harder it will be to remember. Yeah, yeah. It'll come to you eventually. I don't know, but I like a lot of K-pop, mostly girl groups. I like um, SN, SNSD, Girls Generation. Great band. Um, Twice, Cosmic Girls. Um, fucking Four Minute. That's going back. Um, Twenty One. Um, on the metal side, I did like Big Bang. They're not really around anymore, but I did like them. G Dragon, uh, fucking EXO, a little bit, mostly the Japanese singles, um, and obviously a bit of BTS. Like I like Aeroplane; it's a good song. <laughs> I haven't heard much of BTS, but I, I do like it when it comes on the adverts sometimes because they're fucking huge. They're everywhere now; you can't avoid them. Hermione, Ron, and Harry research the secret of the Philosopher's Stone. It could produce the elixir of life, a potion yeah, we all know. anyone in the world. Um, career could the do a lot better looking after their idols. It. Anyone would want it, said Harry. Yeah, no, for me, and Lani like suspected said, that the package Hagrid had taken Japanese, from Gringotts so contained the Philosopher's so Stone. Lisa, I like a bit of stone Lisa, that was down Yui, the Forbidden Corridor, nightmare. being guarded by whatever it was that had growled at them. Mock a good. Flow. What about that Darren Gray? Oh, do it's nasty. Darren Gray actually very idea. suspicious lately. But I know Hermione one song from Orange Caramel. That's an SD. But there's no way Snake bangers. would try anything while Dumbledore's around. Black Pig in your area. Yeah. But Dumbledore left ten minutes ago uh, for the Ministry of Magic in London. Red Velvet, CLC, G Idol. That must mean that tonight's the night. Do I, am I Let's saying G Idol correctly? Shut up, Ram. Am I saying G Idol correctly? Lots of others. Yeah, there's, that's the thing with when you're trying to list off K-pop bands, you always forget a couple. What about Filch? Like, He's always watching the Forbidden Corridor. But yeah. We'll just have to take our chance. No, I like then. all of those. I, I know, like, the K-pop mm. sort of fans get, like, real stanny. They, they, like, they hate certain groups because... It looks like Filch is somewhere They get it all tonight. in their heads that, like, oh, we've got to hate these guys. I literally forgot my favourite anime. But, um... But yeah, I don't do any of that. I'm just like, they're all like really good musicians. Come on, let's I, go. I don't see why there has to be infighting with, with K-pop groups. Fucking Uberworld. Uberworld. How did I forget them? I honestly couldn't give they're a They're my fuck. fucking ringtones. Mad Capsule Market is another good Japanese group. Uh. I think there's a pattern emerging. I like all the really, like the older Japanese rock bands. You like some of the... Not so much newer ones, but like ones that have only really been around for the last 15, 20 years. Um, obviously we like Baby Metal, um, that's the obvious. Yeah, I like a couple I fucking loved Baby Metal. I went through a phase of my life where I collect everything. I've got the Funko Pops. This way, Harry! And they're some of the rarest Funko Pops in the world now. So, um... I'm not usually somebody who will try and get a hold of things just because they're rare, but um, but I got them and they're rare as balls. I can't see chat anymore. I just gotta answer something. Uh, da, 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 da. That's nothing. Um, now we're gonna put the uh, the bear asleep, the the dog, the bear. Fuck I think this is where the growling has been coming from. <laughs> I don't think we should go in there. But we've got yeah, to stop Snake. Go on, Harry. We're right I don't behind know. Bands. I like Enishikari. Um, I made a video about them as well. I kind of regret it because I can do a better one these days. But, um, it's out there. Enishikari are really good, especially if you're into like hardcore, like political bands and like, sort of protest music. This monster, Fluffy. They're really good. This is Fluffy, the free-headed dog. Do be careful. Nah, nah, nah. He wouldn't let me finish. Uh, I'm sure 
where you're getting the idea, it's just you're going to put those to sleep at the same time. Um, but obviously the one, you know, you've got to make it. So. That was fucking easy. That was way too easy. I remember that being a lot harder as a kid. You want to go first, Hermione? No, I don't. Right. See you in a minute. I hope. In the film, he screeches like a bitch when he goes down there. It's okay! It's a soft landing! Oh, you, can you can jump! You can jump, everything's fine. And and then he's just squealing like a bitch because he doesn't know how to get away from like Come on, the Harry! Pad. Devil snare. Whatever. <laughs> um Yeah, we should do a K-pop stream. Obviously we won't be able to like have music, but I'm we... not gonna be able to do shit for that stream. I know, that's why you won't be there, it'll just be me. Fair enough. It's fine. I'll <laughs> you know, I'll do a ranking thing, like a tier list of girl groups maybe, you know. That'd be fun. Or I'll do like an album thing, like a tier list of like classic K-pop albums. I know what this is! It's a devil's snare! Next time I'm gonna pay more attention in herbology. Yeah, you better. Help! It's a devil's snare! Try not to get too close to those tentacles. Oh, otherwise it'll turn into Japan. Incendio! This is wrong on so many levels. I'm only using the vagina spell. Incendio! To propel these protruding rods of a uh, plant. Incendio! Yeah, you know what I mean. Uh, it's just a bit wrong. Incendio! It's a bit wrong. Spells shaped like a vagina, and these things are shaped like this. Yeah. My thesis. <laughs> and they don't make like good noises either. Like... Like physical media or nothing, I just I tend to just download the uh, songs and stick them in my iTunes and there I am. Um, um, sorry, that's the plant. Um, but I don't know. I've been a fan of K-pop since probably around about the same time Gangnam Style. So I'm I'm one of them sort of second wave. You know, because K-pop goes through like the stages of playing more people from the um, We've got the original, the OG lot, but they were around way before Sai even started. But there wasn't many. Um, and then you've got the Gangnam Style trip. Like me, sort of in the kind of like Orange Kano, uh, Ghost Generation, 4 Minute, 21, all that kind of stuff. Uh, Brandia, you know, all those groups. Um, and then I suppose you've got the new groups, you know, the, the fans who came in for either BTS or Black Um Sorry, I've been wasting a lot of time. Incendio. Uh, oh, Incendio. Oh, that thing. That was right up against my body. Incendio. <laughs> I'm sorry. You just said bomb hole. I know. Incendio. I said it in like an old as well, bomb hole. Incendio. Incendio. Big vinyl collection, like records. Incendio. Yeah, vinyl. 
Um, and we're going to do a video where it goes through all of that. I've got some really good stuff. You know, um, we've just got to organise it because some of it I can't really show on YouTube. Um, because I've, I've got some records where they've got the original album covers on that weren't banned. Um, I don't know if you've heard of Guns N' Roses, but they had a version of Appetite for Destruction, which, uh, which had some pretty heavy artwork on it. Um, so I'm going to have to find a way of um, knowing where that is in the pile so I can hand over the offending bits. It's a really cool record. Uh, and then we're doing a giant ass Power Rangers collection. Uh, all the Megazords, all the Morphers, all the figures, all the roleplay toys, all the cards, all the DVDs, videotapes, fucking. Thanks, everything. Harry. That was close, Harry. At some point. This way, Harry. I do, yeah. I've, we've got a Pokemon unboxing coming. Um, it's me, Dion, and Dion's brother, Tez. Uh, Neozeki. He's in chat. Uh, yeah, Guns N' Roses, they're a really, a really old sort of like glam rock, sort of classic rock. Have, they sort of straddle that line between glam rock and like classic rock. Because they don't really look like a glam band, but they kind of sound like one. So. You have to catch the key, Harry! Um, Time to put your yeah. Quidditch skills to practice. So I'm going to be uploading a ah. Pokemon unboxing. So if you're into Pokemon, you can watch it. If you're Good not, luck, then, Harry. Then you can avoid it at all costs. Uh, there we go. We have to. The, this is the bit where, if you've seen the film, you'll know that the the keys don't like it when you try and get hold of one of them. So they'll attack to save their brethren. Although it looks like another snitch in this game for some reason rather than a key. I'm getting my ass kicked by these keys. This is actually quite tough. Yeah, Neo Zeki. It is extremely old. Um, this game came out in 20... no, 2001, I think. So yeah, it's like 20 years old. Um, surprised we got it working in the end at all. We do have a, an actual copy, but it didn't work for some reason. So we've had to find like a ROM on the internet and we're using that instead. Um, but it is legal. We've got, we've got a legal copy of the game. We just couldn't use that to, to stream. So we've had to get like a one that's been sort of broken open, so we don't have to worry about the um, the age-old uh, DRM. Basically, I think that's what stops it. A lot of old games have issues like that where the DRM. Um, the next puzzle is a gigantic chessboard. Doesn't work anymore. You know, gone through to play. They've turned the servers off. So right. You know what I mean? Like they've, they've left the locks on, but they've. Um, the keys aren't available anymore, so you can't get into those games, they're just locked up. And it's unfortunate. But if you know what you're doing, you can you can break the lock off and you can just access the game. Like whoever I got this file off of. Oh Ron, are you alright? I've defeated most of the pieces. But, but if I've been EA hurt. want to, it's up to uh, you now, Harry. Up, I'll have to show them my box because <sighs> I've got a box copy of this. Harry. You have to be careful and avoid the pieces. This is what I was on about earlier. The, the pieces just kind of move You'll wherever the fuck the please. You'll have to make the pieces fight each other in order to get across safely. Walk onto the board, Harry, to start the game. Do be careful. Yeah, I, 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 I don't... I haven't enjoyed a new game for ages. A lot of the games I like are quite old. Like, I like Doom. The original Doom is just... You can play it endlessly. Anyway, I think I'm going to go on this one. And they fight. But there's no real thing to it, they just kind of... Yeah. That one's supposed to be able to move like a bunch of times. Um, and then we 
just have to snake our way around the board and make sure they can't reach us. Um, but I always can't remember the order, so... Any any Brainiacs in the, um, in the chat? Uh, if we go there, that's going to move forward and hit us. So maybe I'll go here. I'm not going to say the old game industry was great, but the studios were smaller, so they weren't able to get away with as much abuse as they do these days. These days it all kind of blends into a sort of mess. Ah, uh, we're fine. <laughs> yeah. I take it everyone's heard of uh, Ubisoft and the titular EA. Both are full of absolute. Are you just going to completely disregard that we love the fuck out of Pokemon? Oh, Which Ron, are you like alright? I've defeated most of the pieces, but I've been hurt. It's up to you now, Harry. <sighs> to be fair, Nintendo are one of the least Harry, you have to be careful and avoid the pieces. They oh, all move lucky, one square at a time. Uh, You'll have to make the pieces fight each other in order to get across safely. True. Walk yeah. onto the board, Harry, to start the game. Well, Do I don't know. I, I've not got like an Xbox One or a Switch or a PS4 or 5. I stopped buying consoles about the time the PS3 came out and the Xbox 360. Um, I think the newest console we've got is a Wii U. I think that's probably the newest, as new as I get. Uh, I play most of that stuff. Everyone said, get fucked, get good. Yeah, I'm attempting it. Uh. And it, it does fucking count. I don't care if it's a remake. It's not this, It's not like a port. It's a different fucking game. Alright, so bring rivalry. I'm going to go this way this time. Or am I? That worked last time, actually. If I go that way, and then that makes them fight at the back. Or does it? And then I'll just for myself. So we're going to go back here. And then they fight. And I imagine we can just... Do they have to be diagonal for the fighting to... I think I might have just played myself because I, if I go there he's going to whack me and if I go into one of these diagonal bits he's going to whack me. I'll go here. Yeah, just fucking dickhead. Look at that. He's just slapping me off like I'm a fly or something, you know? Ah, uh, you're emulation queen. I'm an original hardware queen. Until all my consoles start dying, and then I'm probably going to turn into an emulation queen. Between the two of us, we've got like the majority of consoles that Yeah, you've got an Xbox One, so I don't know. Oh, Ron, are yeah, you alright? Yeah, I've got an Xbox One, I've got a 3D. I've defeated so most far. of the pieces. Oh, there's so many games. But I've been hurt. Battery. It's up to there's you so now, There's so many Harry. games that I have yet <sighs> to play that I've wanted to play. Harry. You have to be careful and avoid so the pieces. So as we live together, they all move one Leon's square at a time. Leon's gonna like a twenty quid note. You'll have to make the pieces like fight each other in order to get across safely. Doom 2016. Walk onto the board, Harry, to start you the game. You've got the time. I'll do. Do be careful. Like, with you and you'll have a drop, and I'll be at the time. Sure. 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 No, you're thinking in the future. Well, far future, yeah. But for now, um, I guess it will. Be. You know what I mean. I'll, I'll one day I'll go out and I'll get a bunch of games, and it's gonna be. Should come, come back with like a huge bag full of video yeah. games. Mirror's Edge Catalyst, um, Attack and 6, no, 7, yeah, uh, DOA 6. And when we 
go, go back on ourselves. That's what put us in. No, it was the move after that that I fucked up with, wasn't it? Oh no. They should be kicking ass. They should be killing each other. Don't chase me. Um, see, that should be able to happen. You are a bishop. You attack diagonally. What the fuck? I think I might need some brain power. What do, what do you suggest? I've got no idea because there are your chests as well. I know. This is what I talked about earlier. It's just like, that's not chess. <laughs> yeah, if there's any like quick tracks. Oh, Ron, are you alright? I wish I could skip I've this. I've defeated most stuff. of the pieces, but I've been hurt. It's up to you now, Harry. <sighs> Harry, you have to be careful and avoid the pieces. They all move one square at a time. You'll have to make the pieces fight each other in order to get across safely. Walk onto the board, Harry, to start the game. Do be careful. Okay, so... I wonder what happens if I walk on this bit instead. Apparently, your first move, you go, like, onto that green square, which is um, flat. I'll see if I can do it this time. If I fail, then help me. Are we gonna? No. No. Okay. Um... So just gonna crash. Uh, are you gonna fight? Fight. Fuck. And I go down one. Yeah. Yeah. Bullshit. I failed. It's quite difficult to know which way to go. There's the neighbours again. We are near the end of the game though. There's only like two more rooms. Um, one involves. Oh, three actually. There's. Yeah, there's that one where you've got to like avoid it's like throwing rifles and shit at you. Oh Ron, are you alright? I've defeated most of the pieces. But I've been hurt. It's up to you now, Harry. <sighs> Harry, you have to be careful and avoid the pieces. They all move one square at a time. You'll have to make the pieces fight each other in order to get across safely. Okay. Walk onto the board, so Harry, to start first. the game. Do be careful. Then on to the white one for the white. Yeah. Mostly right then. First attempt. I'm just gonna fuck up the last one. And then I said go to the one in front of you. The green. No, 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 other, yeah. other side, fuck around. This one? Yes. Well, that's what it said. Okay, that didn't work. 
It mostly works. Uh... I had a feeling that wouldn't work. I've been, I've been hit by that before. In that way. Uh, how's Chat doing, Bye. Oh, Ron, are you alright? I've defeated most of the pieces. But I've been hurt. It's up to you now, Harry. <sighs> Harry, you have to be careful and avoid the pieces. They all move one square at a time. I did not betray you her. You have to make I the pieces fight each other in order to get across safely. Walk onto the board, Harry, to start the game. The wiki Do nice. be careful. So real. Done it. Fair enough. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Here he said you're smooth brain. Or he said I'm smooth brain. One of us is smooth Probably brain. Probably both of us. <laughs> <laughs> now we have this thing where the potions are gonna like sort of you you've gotta pick the right potion and they're gonna be like Zooming round, you oh know. Oh god, you made me do this last time, didn't you? I've got a keen eye this time. And as soon as I've done this bit, I need a piss break, so I'll, I'll need a couple of minutes. In fact, I might do that now. Um, just entertain chat for like two minutes. Okay, dog. We are nearly done with the game now, so you'd be pleased to know you can probably finish the stream with me and then still get right back. I hope so, because I've got some, quite a bit of shit I need to do. Yeah, I know. 500 fucking minutes. <laughs> she fluctuates between being pro gamer and stupid game. I'm the same. Terry, which one of us were you calling Smooth Brain, by the way? I'm just curious. Because if it's me, we can have a fight. Wow, rude. Fuck you. I think I'll beat you up when I get home. Apparently it was me he was calling Smooth Brain. I'm just gonna need my drink off. You're missing quite a few, so. I'm pretty sure I've got my, um, the chance of getting all. I don't know, I've tried my best. Put, you might want to put my phone on charge because I'm going to need it back at 7 because of that eBay thing. Oh, yeah. Uh, we're we're gunning for a bunch more Pokemon cards. We ain't going to tell you what they are or where they are, though. Because we want them. <sighs> well, I say we. Do you want them? I do. I'm going to probably be more than happy with whatever I get tomorrow. Who's 
I would like a korma, if that's possible. If we're doing that, okay. Lasagna? Uh, sandwiches? Rice? Peanuts? Uh, nothing? Dust? I guess we'll be finishing off without Dion today then. Oh no! Oh yeah. The exit is blocked by magic fire. Once we get to mm. Looks like you have to choose the right potion. Be careful, though. Harry. It could be poison. About twenty minutes. This yeah. one looks like it will help us through the fire. Watch oh, closely. Sure. Keep your eye on the correct potion. Right. I can't really watch chat now. I've got to watch the potions. That one. Lependo. Here it goes again. Right in front of me. Nope, wrong. Wrong. What are you doing, Harry? Poison myself because I, I fucking Lependo. don't know which one that was. I don't think I picked that one, but then I could be wrong. I think Hermione's just uh, told us we're gonna die. <sighs> oh no! Yep. Ah! <coughs> that last one was ridiculous. Oh, you 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 guys have got keen eyes, ain't you? But the yeah, uh, I could do with the frame rate slowing down a bit. It'd actually be beneficial for this part. Oh no! The exit is blocked by magical fire. Looks like you have to choose the right potion. Be careful, Harry. It could be poison. Right. This one looks like it will help it's us It's easy the, the first couple of times, but then it just Watch goes super speed. Watch closely. Keep your eye on the correct potion. Then choose wisely. on the right on the the left sorry Nintendo! here it goes again Sand. We've 
got it. Oh, not again. Now, that's ridiculous. Yeah, it fucking is. Fuck, it was difficult keeping my eyes open that time. Um, again, I think it's round here on this side. Harry, you picked the right one. Okay. Expert. You've got to find Snape on your own. I'll go back and help Ron. Good luck, Harry. Okay. So Hermione just kind of left. She didn't have to, but if she did. This might be the last wizard card. Oh, it's just beans. What about beans? That is not a snake. That is Professor Quirrell. Um, like I said earlier, we could have just flippendoed him into a wall and ripped that hat off his head and uh, ended the game early but yeah, we had to draw loads of pretty pictures instead. That was awkward. There we are. And this is the penultimate room. wondered whether I'd be meeting you here, Potter. I suppose you were expecting someone else. So well, it's me, scared, stuttering Professor not let us get anywhere near that door. You're far too inquisitive to remain among the living. <laughs> and we're going to just come anyway. Uh, Ow! Yeah, that, that fucking hurts, that green shit. Uh, but it does provide cover. Yeah, so. Pendo! Yeah, Pendo! And he's also occasionally going to knock the bits back, so... Like that, yeah. Nipendo. Very annoying. Nipendo. But you can't push them back Nipendo. once we've got them on one of these bits. Yeah. Nipendo. So... Nipendo. 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 And the frame rate's holding gone. Flipendo! 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 Right, we got that bit. I don't think he's going to be moving that back anytime soon. Flipendo! Flipendo! Right. I don't think we need all, all four bits. We might do though. I might, I might do that. Lipendo! Doesn't seem like it though. Lipendo! 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 Oh, that's fucking annoying. Lipendo! got me. And then Harry just stands on the box. That was not intended. It's not the best place for him to be. He is a risk taker after all. Um, the, the frame rate is dying. Um, it's 10 times harder than it needs to be. Um, I believe we need health. We are actually at risk of... He's uh, a bit angry. You know? Flipendo! Out! Ow! Oh. Flipendo! Flipendo! I think we're just about made it. Flipendo! Look at me barely scraping through a kid's game. Right. 
and then he's gonna walk Cass away. Is Potter. You will not succeed again. We could have just punched him right there, but no. Just could have just stuck the wand up his ass and told him to do one. But no, we have to do epic boss battle in there. In the, that, that's where the mirror is. Dion. Final boss. <laughs> Dion's going to be back in a minute. And we are at the final bit of the game. Give me the stone. Let me speak to him face to face. Yeah, this bit might be a bit scary. Master, you're not strong enough. In the film, it's definitely I like a bit just like, oh, a bit. Yeah, he takes his turban off and. Uh, <laughs> happy fucking Christmas. <laughs> Like, that would shit me up if I saw somebody just do a, a fucking exorcism. Exorcism. Yeah, Reagan. And he just looks fucking gormless. That is a white face. If I ever saw one. He's a pale boy. And now we basically um, knock like columns on his on his head. And eventually he'll get so angry that he just pummels all the columns. You and then we have to go to the um, and we have to go to the mirror. <laughs> Maybe I can cast the pendants on the just He occasionally does a homing attack. So. Um, we need to get him right in front of him. It's his spells. And we now back in the way. He's just gonna destroy that one, yeah. Yeah, now he's fucking pissed. Now he's fucking angry. This means business. And now we have to get right down in there and just kind of. Uh, he's, 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 these are his homing attacks. You have to just kind of outrun them. This is ridiculous. I'm sorry, guys. It should be a bit quicker than this, but uh, and he kind of just gets angry and then starts like firing his um, spells. As you can see, they um, repel back at him. So. And over the because he's uh, got a little bit of intelligence, not much, mind. Okay, the lag seems to be affecting my ability. Uh, can you go into turn? Yeah, it's turning. This frame rate is eight. Like, oh shit, it's a homing attack. This is 
probably the slowest it's been the entire game. Quite a great way to finish it. It's the green shit, isn't it? That's what's slowing the game down. Start near that other column, which means they will be able to. Uh, oh, that didn't quite work out. Here's look at the draw, really, where the, where the mirror stops. It's a bit of RNG. But eventually, he's in the perfect spot, and so is the mirror. I think he's only got another couple of like, two shots, and I think we'll have one. He's in the perfect place, we just need to outrun this and then drop back. Although I think he's moving. Ah! Okay. We've got to start being careful ourselves. We haven't got much help. Okay, now it's a question of who first. More than I think we've probably got like two more hits. And the mirror didn't move. One point. He's gonna do one of his own things, probably. Which I think is a bit of a cheap shot, really, because you can't really avoid them without running, running around a bunch. Yep, that one's a uh, attack. Yeah. He's, he's excited by that. Well, with a frame rate like this, I'm doing quite well. Oh, we got him. We got him. First attempt, boys. Cutscenes left. Everyone's gonna have a good laugh, and then we're gonna play a tiny bit of Quidditch, and then we're done. Cancel. Dumbledore smiled. What happened down in the dungeons between yourself and Professor Quirrell is a complete secret, he said. So naturally, the whole school knows. <laughs> the stone had been destroyed, but Harry remained fearful that its loss would not prevent Lord Voldemort's return. Dumbledore nodded, sharing his concern. Nevertheless, Harry, if our battles do no more than slow Voldemort's return, with luck he may never regain his power at all. Spoilers, he does. Harry made his way down to the end of the year feast alone that night. The great hall was decked out in green and silver to celebrate Slytherin winning the House Cup. When Harry entered, there was a sudden hush. He took a seat between Ron and Hermione, trying to ignore the stares of the other students. The House Cup, announced Dumbledore, is awarded to the team with the most house points. At the moment, and that would seem to be to Slytherin. Like sharp move of just like handing a storm out loads of cheering of and stamping broke out from the Slytherin table. Just at the last minute. 
Meaning that we win instead. However, continued Dumbledore, in recognition yeah. of Mr. Harry Potter's pure nerve and outstanding courage, I award Gryffindor 60 points. Harry's table erupted with cheers and applause. I've done the maths, The additional points had won the house cup for Gryffindor. We, we were more than 60 points behind. No, but in the film, he gives points It was to the best the evening of Harry's life. Better than winning at Quidditch or Christmas or knocking out mountain trolls. He would never, I'm ever I'm pretty sure he doesn't like remembering knocking out mountain trolls. I'm pretty sure that wasn't like a epic day, you know? It's definitely not a day he'd forget, but nonetheless, I don't think it's a day he'd be like, oh, I remember that time? That was really fun, that was. End of the game. Although, we are going to find out what Fred and George was doing with the beans. This bit's fucking hilarious. Yeah, the end screen's a bit. <laughs> the end. It's anyway, been. Here we go. Fred and George. Snape's about to have a bit of a surprise. <laughs> oh dear, they're going to take all those beans and they're going to stuff them up his ass. One by one. No, not really. We can imagine now. That's one. Mm. <laughs> and then it's just <laughs> And that's the experiment they were doing with the beans. <laughs> and I think we've given them about 80 of those beans, so I'm pretty sure they were asking other students to get beans to them as well. Pretty sure we went on our own there. Um, guess what? One, two, three. We've missed out on three uh, wizard cards. So, uh, there we go. That's the that's the end of the game. Um, but I want to show you something quickly that I didn't get earlier. This is uh, broomstick practice again. This area's got a wizard card in it. Which means we've missed two, actually, so... It's not too bad. I've, I've, I've done worse before. True. We're not going to bother with the rings this time. We're just going to try and get into that, that bit, because I got a pretty good score last time. Playing with it. Welcome back, Mr. Potter. Now, let's begin your training. The speed up and slow down keys adjust your flight speed. Well, if you get all the cards, it unlocks Potter, another card. On my whistle, then. So you just basically collect all the cards and then it gives you your, your completion card. Um, it didn't give us that card though because we, uh, we didn't get them all open. Please open. It was in here. It was in here. Okay, I guess we missed it. Oh, well, that looks to it. It's quite a fun area to just kind of fly around. In. Now let's see how you do with smaller ones. Well done, Mr. Potter. Oh, 
these rings should challenge you. actually beat my old score. I've wasted a bunch of time. A skillful display, Mr. Potter. Yeah. Fifteen points for Gryffindor. Epic. I also congratulate you for being the first student to find the secret room since 1867. Which would have had a card in it. Nope. I'm done. Have with another that. go at it if you'd like. Press escape if you'd rather yep. leave. Uh. And there's also Quidditch, the league. Um, anyone want to see a bit of Quidditch? Uh, well, that's an extra bit of the game, but we've basically done the game. Uh, that's not going to show us anything. Do we now have? Ah, uh, it saves it there as well. Fair enough. Um. So, so we've reached the end of the stream, I think. I um, hope everyone's had fun. Um, we'll play this again soon. Um, we have Zoo Tycoon planned for January. Um, we have another video probably coming out tonight. It's the uh, Pokemon unboxing. Um, but we will leave you now to enjoy your Christmas, yes. as we will as. Um, so yeah. I'll have to exit the game properly. Yeah, because that's the way she can't access it. Second. Um. So yeah. Yeah, it's Sue Tycoon. That's the next one. Um, and then maybe Monopoly, maybe Virtua Cop 2, maybe um, House of the Dead 3. There's lots of stuff we have planned. Um, I don't really want to go. I'm having fun. But we've kind of got nothing else to do. So we're going to have to go. It's so. very sad. Okay, have a great evening, everybody. Uh, we'll leave you be. All right. Goodbye.